Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to solve the given partial differential equation. This is of the form capital P into small p plus capital Q into small q equal to capital R. Now, rewriting this equation, we have zx and that is multiplied with small p. By writing this, we can understand that capital P is zx. In the same way, here we need capital Q into small q. So, that is zy into small q and the last term is xy and from this we get capital P is zx, capital Q is zy, capital R is xy. To get the solution, we have to solve dx by capital P equal to dy by capital Q equal to dz by capital R and from this dx by zx equal to dy by zy equal to dz by xy. Now by taking two terms at a time that is taking the first and second then second and third we are going to get the solution. Writing the first and second we get dx by zx equal to dy by zy. After cancelling this, it is of the variable separable form. On integration, we get log x equal to log y. Since both are log, instead of the constant c1, we take log c1. Using the log rule, we get log x is equal to log of y into c1. Removing log x is equal to y c1. From this, c1 is x by y and this is taken as u that is u is x by y. In the same way taking the last two term we get dy by zy equal to dz by xy. We can cancel y on both the sides and now we notice that this is dy by z and this is dz by x. So we have dy and dz but we have a variable x here, so we cannot integrate this. But from the first solution, the value of x is y into c1. So, I am going to replace here dy by z equal to dz by y into c1. Now, we are going to cross multiply. That is y c1 into dy equal to z dz. Now we got variable separable form, we are going to integrate, c1 is a constant, we keep as it is and y integration is y square by 2, z is z square by 2 plus constant c2. Taking this to the other side, we are going to get c1 y square by 2 minus z square by 2 equal to c2 and taking LCM we get c1 y square minus z square equal to c2. So, c1 y square minus z square is equal to 2c2. Now, replacing c1 from here, c1 is x by y. So, we replace here, that is here, x by y into y square minus z square is equal to 2c2. After cancelling this, we get xy minus z square and we are going to take this as v. Now using this u and v, we are going to give the general solution and our general solution is f of u comma v equal to 0 and so f of x by y comma xy minus z square equal to 0. So, we got the general solution for the given partial differential equation by Lagrange's method.